Hey, oh, don't give him a name. Yep. Right. <coughs> Welcome to our meeting. Uh, apologies for absence. Book has gone round. Uh, Clough and Fenton. All those in favour? Thank you. Disclosures of interest. None received. Minutes of previous meeting as circulated. All those in favour? Thank you. Any confidential items I can think of? Public participation. And that blind one for not coming out it's tonight. A bit, <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a bit nippy, and that <laughs> yellow snow bomb warning went down really well with one and a half millimetres at home. Hey, getting to work today, but uh, breeze. Hardly any traffic on the road. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Ongoing issues. Notified planning panels. None. Notified appeals. None. Previous planning applications, and please refer to the uh, new one that's on here. And we're doing all right. Any questions, comments? We've got, let's say, 80% correct. Okay. Yeah. It's not correct, is it? It is. <laughs> it's I, I feel, I feel like this is, this is the teacher mark in the work, yeah. isn't it, Oliver? So we think we think we got the right answers, but <laughs> Bradford's got the wrong answers for some. Sometimes yeah. Bradford don't say. have the same opinion <laughs> that we do. Yeah, yeah. Right. So noted. Consideration of planning applications. All right, we will go to number one, which is 28 Trinity Place, Bingley. Construction of rear single storey extension, pitch roof, various windows, disabled access, demolition of garage. There is one objection. We and there's one support. Oh, is there now one support? Yeah, there's one support. So, I, I, so it's one each. I just it? had a look this afternoon, so it sort of cancels it out, doesn't it? Well, it depends whether any of them were valid or not, mm, but there we go. I don't know. Um, yeah, you're right. Well, if you actually go down back of Trinity, there's all sorts of garages, extensions. Yeah. I don't have an issue with it no, whatsoever, so, yeah. so I'd, I'd move approve. Yeah. Unless anybody's. I wouldn't disagree with that. I'll propose. I'll second it if you propose it. All in favour? Yeah. Right, number two and number three, we can't comment on because Bradford's already done it. Never proved them. So we move on to number four, which is five Cavendish Drive, Eldwick. When I looked, there were zero comments. Yep. There's a whole mixture of. Uh, Again, there's been no e array of property developments. Extensions yeah. up, down, left, right. Um, there is a precedent there. I don't have an issue with it particularly. I would agree with you. Well, happy I move approval mm, then. Yeah. Yeah. I'll second that. Uh, second it, Rachel. All in favour? Yeah. Thank you. <coughs> right, number five. Sunny Bank, Otley Road. Remind me what that one is. Part one story, part two story, rear and side extension so it's as you go down past Nigel's on the left there's those sort of um, semi-detached oh yeah as yeah. you go down towards War Memorial yeah then that back onto the wreck well it would are they, yeah, the just field, yeah. Wreck. yeah there's there again there's there, there, alterations yeah various alterations um, is this the one, or is, is this the, the previous one that's very close to the boundary? I, I was just thinking, is this the one that had two conservatories, or was that the other one? No, that's another one. I think one. that was a different well, one. Well, one, one of those houses down there, there's a, a lad I know who's got a very disabled child, and uh, he's had an extension it's, put to his house. It's got it has two been conservatories. built right to the perimeter. You just go down, oh, they've yeah. got two conservatories, and they're just making, making it into, into a, one. Yeah, fine. Extended it out, haven't they? Yeah. Um, um, you know, it, it didn't buy whatever anything that they're doing years removing access to garage because you couldn't get a car down there <laughs> anyway. <so. laughs> yeah, I, I saw. I thought it looked okay, yeah. and again, that sort of area, people have added bits. Yeah, and there's all sorts of bits to, and bobs done to houses. Down to houses. Do we have a, a proposal? I would propose that. 
I'll second it. All those in favour? Pardon? You give me uh, move on to number 6, 130 Main Street, uh, change of use from hairdressing to uh, uh, dental surgery. Uh, I did have a look, uh, and there were no comments as of yesterday. Um, I was watching a historical thing where the actual uh, barbers were the dentists as well. You <laughs> barber, barber surgeons. Yeah, mm, yeah they used to come and knock your teeth out They used to do well. minor, minor, <laughs> minor surgery, yeah, because they had the sharp things. Um, I would say, if I'm a major, um, we need dentists, don't mm -hmm. we? And if, if we look down fur further down on the agenda, somebody's asking, somebody asked for permission to... Hairdress. a bit to, further to, to, to actually... Add a hairdresser, so it's we're not exactly losing a well, hairdresser, are we? we well, if we look at how many hairdressers, yeah. 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 that's next one down. Yeah, that's actually, next yeah. one down. Sure. I, I don't think anyone you wanna, you wanna disagree to a dental surge. I, I would, I would, um, oh, I would propose. I don't, I don't think we, we can anyway, really, can we? Because it's lawful, not a lawful development. It's only alteration internally. It. It's only internal alterations, yeah, yeah, yeah. really, isn't it? It's not yeah. anything the external of the building. I suppose the only thing might be if we were, if we wanted to. A bit of reinstatement of the external yeah, of the yeah. building, but to, as they're not so, I mean, I think it's fantastic. I'm glad yeah. somebody's taking it. I mean, yeah. <laughs> what you don't want to do is have an empty building, yeah. exactly. Right, so we'll move on to number seven, uh, 31 South Hill Drive, Gilstead. Uh, change of part of use of property from it's a lounge, isn't it? It's it's the use in the front room yeah. as a hairdresser's. Uh -huh. uh, there's no comments at the moment. Now, I did look at their. Um, statement and it does say they're wanting it for part time hairdressing but I think 9.30 to 4.30 or 5 yeah. most days isn't part time that's a full time Is business Saturday as well yes yeah, that's yeah but I, th I think what it says isn't it there's only ever going to be one one customer there but at once, once. You've, once you've got planning yeah. then they put another chair in it's a residential area South Hill Drive is like yeah. that um <laughs> I'm not yeah. over fond of <coughs> introducing commercial into purely residential roads. Is she not? Mm. Are they not hairdressing already there? Well, maybe she will to regularise it. It says that it will allow her to continue her career, but yeah. as she sold yeah. up for a dentist to move in on Main Street. Is that what it is? No, we don't know. No, we just we just conjure. We just gone conjure. We don't. We have no idea. Do conclusion. Yeah. I, to be honest, I'm not convinced about. You know, once they've got one in, there'll be two in, and then there's more cars, and it's narrow down there. And if they get stuck down there in winter, they'll never get out. If I may say, um, a lot of people do work from home nowadays. Mm. This is this is. I would say. Um, I think there'll be many that going, are doing it. Going back oh, to yeah. the working from home, to even if we go back, uh, if I put my um, historian's hat on, going back a few hundred years where people lived where they worked, so a baker's would live above the bakery, for example. Sure, when I was a kid, people did Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so well, that's, I, all that's why it's <laughs> disarray. I think that the, the worry for me would be perhaps parking. I'm not too mm. familiar with the area. Oh, but, well, they've said they've got off-street parking, and I think they have. There's a small drive. There's a small, yeah. very small drive, but if there's... If there's only going to be one up. person there at once, which... which sorry. <laughs> that is conjecture, isn't it? Well, no, that's what they've said. So, that's conjecture. Well, yeah. no, but we could ask for a condition that stipulates that that is absolutely what, what you should happen. You, you won't, unfortunately, I don't think you'd get one just to... I mean, no, at the end of the day, I don't think, you know, I think it's reasonable. People working from home and... Yeah. and uh, the fact that there's no objections, they're probably all customers anyway. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, they're probably doing it. They're probably regularising what they're doing. If it's e easier yeah. for some people to just nip down the road to the hairdresser rather than having to go all the way into Bingley. Well, I have my opinion. Like a well, that sounds does any, does yeah. anybody want to make a proposal? I will propose it. I'll no, second. Billy has seconded it. All those in favour? Four, four, mm. four and one against. Oh, well, no, if against... <coughs> it's against against business people, obviously. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Bear with me a second. We will then be moving on to number eight, Toils Farm. This is Harold Robinson up for um, 
who was an architect, who was a structural engineer, an architect, and Uncle Tom Cobbley and all. So, and what he's altering is a, is a, one of the one of the windows along there. So, taking it to from, it was it is a window at the moment. He's taking it down to ground level, so he's extending it. But it is a listed building. It is that, a listed that, building. That's that, the issue. That, that, that and is I don't issue know whether he, I don't know if he's putting it back to what it was. It says reinstatement. It says reinstatement. Yeah. But yeah, when but you I actually look at the pictures, it looks actually all of it fairly modern. Yeah. Well, I think it's, it's don't like it say a reinstatement to how it was in 2000, yeah. not a reinstatement mm. to how that it was, was in 1770, whatever. Yeah. To be honest, it's miles away from anywhere. You can't see it from road. No, no. I don't think it's a dream. I don't think it's a problem, personally, but... I would have thought from a conservation point of view, given that it's taking out mullion windows and putting well, the modern. in soft wood frames instead. Well, the modern, the mullions. Well, the existing windows. I know they're modern, but, but they're in keeping well, with the, the, the original character of the building. Like. Are the existing windows? It's, that, there is some, it's the window yeah, next there is to some the um, pictures somewhere. So that that's, that's the existing window. That's yeah. The, yeah, yeah. And what's the it's just going down to the floor. floor. It's going down to the floor with it. If you actually if you actually look at there's statement if you actually look at the statement there's some pictures I think of the existing yeah you got to scroll down till it catches up he's got that windmill isn't he that that uh... yeah further on can you go ah oh, there you go that's what he's taking out. And putting down to the floor. Oh, you can you can you see, see that there. originally there yeah. was. Yeah, it has been filled in. That's say so crack on. Yeah, yeah. 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 Firstly, I'd propose that. I'll second that. All in favour. All those in favour. Four. Five, one. All those against. One. I thought he'd do it if he put mullions in and made it made it as it was. All right. <laughs> well, we have. have they're not the putting soft wood in, bro. No, but, um, yeah. Maybe. It's too late, we can't go back now. No, no, it's <laughs> no, 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 done now. not going back. No, no, <laughs> the gavel's gone no. down. We can't, can't, see, we can't, we can't see it oh, yes, for a little bit Right, so if we move on to um, Cardamom license application, uh, there is a paper there that highlights what they're, they're wanting to do. Yeah, it's it looks like they're trying to extend from an 11 o'clock finish to a 12 o'clock finish and then uh, on a Friday and Saturday 12.30 and New Year's Eve 12.30. I don't have an issue with it. It's a lot less than a lot of other stuff it in Bingley, isn't it? Yeah. It would yeah. seem churlish to us. It would, yeah. So we would support said application. Yeah, I'd propose, propose that. Yeah. Yeah. I'll second it. All those in favour? Unanimous. All right. Date of next meeting, potentially 13th of February. Yay, snow permitting. Happy with that? Yeah. yeah. Chaps yeah, and yeah. chapasses. And we don't need to exclude the press or public, so... You might have beaten Howard's record. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, right, thank you all for attending. Meeting closed.